I'm turning out of vehicles. Gonna have a lot of fun today. The, the youngest Kiwi off-roading member. <laughs> Here we go, the start of our Puto Point trip across the beach. Finally we catch up to Fred, who's in the front. Vikrant from Raven Overlanding is joining us in his JK. Nice, nice of him to join us on a trip. Just got word that a vehicle stuck, so we're backtracking to go help out. We have to be quick with this recovery because the tide is coming in as well. You got some content bro. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to yank on him too hard and wreck his vehicle so we ended up using some sand tracks just to make the cover a bit easier and faster.
when you're doing a recovery it's good to keep an eye on the rope in this case the rope started wrapping around the Volkswagen's tire so we had to stop him and reset the whole thing Donuts over that side in your Jeep. Okay. That's the one clean driver like you stole it. Put the foot down! So when a gladiator driver drives a Raptor, he gets a stuck in the middle of a crevice. Uh, got into a bit of a sticky situation. The crew finally turned up and then winched me out. So at least everybody had a good laugh. Fred in the JK is the first one to hit the dune to the lighthouse and makes it first go. The rest of us actually struggled a bit to get up. Or well, some of us, not all of us.
On the third go, the Raptor finally makes it up. All about driving style as well as power to get up these dunes. Fred had to drive a couple of vehicles up for other people, but we managed to get every single vehicle up to the lighthouse, which is pretty cool. And we're off to find some more little tracks and stuff to play in. Fred thought he could drive it up, but even he failed, we ended up winching it up. What a gorgeous day to be at Puto Point. The guys are giving me shit for not making up, but I don't want to give it too much power the first go. Second time, but too much power. This was another gnarly section. Again, Fred took over from the owner to try and get it up. Uh, after a couple of goes, he actually managed to get one of them up, but the second one wouldn't go up, so then we ended up turning around and backtracking again.
Oh, got the fire going, got some nice big pieces, got some extra wood to last us a while. Hitesh, you all good? Yep, I'm all good, brother. What a, what a great campsite. Uh, some of the boys up here near the lighthouse trying their luck at some fish. But it was meant to rain, but it's turned out to be a really beautiful day. Bit windy, but all good. Starting to set up camp. Hitish is using the eye camp for the first time. Again, what a lovely spot. It's coming. That's the proper way to get out of What's it? Me, I just ripped mine out with How's the day? <laughs> Great evening. I got this magic chili bin and I just open it and more food arrives in it every time. <laughs> it sounds like my barbecue. Yeah. <laughs> How's the fire? Bad, Greg. Jason, did you see him put his food in your chili bin? Early morning at Puto Point, with us still holding up and playing ball for us. We park up for one more photo with the lighthouse. If you look really carefully, you can see it in the background. Heading back home now, but we decided to go around the lighthouse and exit the opposite side on a mainly gravel road that leads all the way back to Dagulum. Red Axe for a charger for his phone, completely dead, so a little high speed maneuver of passing the power bank from window to window. Toolbox is back out again. Yeah, as always, never, this group never seems to disappoint. And broken airline hose for the compressor. Uh, Mr. Fred is busy fixing again, hopefully. Can we have words of wisdom for the camera, please? <laughs> You've gone very quiet. It does tell me that you need to talk a little bit more on the video. As I said, I absolutely do agree. Our patient needs to talk a little bit more. No, I feel it should be a team effort. Yeah, I'm just trying to think we should have put another one around there to try and hold because I think it's just going to pull off. Yeah, but let me have faith. We don't need this negativity. Now. Now. <laughs> That's the last thing we need. We're all about positivity and Kiwi off roading. That's exactly it. Right, you should take the people through this toolbox that you built. Ah, you should. Do the honors there. And what you've used and what you've done. It's a bit all over the show at the moment. the notch, notch goes into the notch.
that also cut? No, no, no. Come on, Clinton. It's a problem, you're never on the tools, so you don't know how it works. ready for next time. Any words of advice? Always my shirt. Look, that's the freight that I've working again. Slow, I think. There's a lot of air in these tires, right? Yeah.